Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. I am sorry I'm doing this video kind of in a quick. I don't know what happened with the original video with Ultra Magnus. Um, it was working fine and then I just got a notification that uh, the screen is completely black. So I'm gonna be posting just that part that I'm doing the transformation where I put the, uh, um, the sh uh, not the hand shoulder pads, but actually the uh, cover of the hands of Ultra Magnus and what it covers the hands. So I'm just gonna put that part um, because basically that's that's all it really matters for, for the video. Uh, everything else is just the same. You've probably seen Ultra Magnus many times in many other videos. So I don't know what happened with that on YouTube. So I'm just gonna cut that video and just put that part edited with this introduction video. That's all it is. So I'm over here at Walmart early in the morning. <laughs> see if I can get something new, see if there's anything new in there. So anyway, so sorry, I apologize for the original video. I don't know what happened. I didn't know until somebody actually let me know. So I appreciate that. And then, um, yeah, so I'm going to uh, go ahead and just watch this video. And it's just basically the, area, the part where I do the transformation and when I put the uh, uh, the fix for the hands. Okay. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> Please let me know if you have any issues on the videos. Let me know and I'll fix them right away. Okay. All right. Well, I'll see what I can do for it. All right, thanks. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye. Okay, everybody, so let's start with transformation. But before we go with that, I just wanted to let you know, guys, that you guys are here for a treat because a lot of people have been complaining about this figure of Ultra Magnus because it shows the hands on the owl mode. Now, I'm here working late at night on my reviews. And if I sound a little bit down, that's because I'm tired, <laughs> to be honest with you. Because this is the past hour that I usually do my reviews. I and mean, we're talking about 2 or 3 in the morning right now. But I wanted to finish this review because I felt that it's really important that I do this. Now, I figured out how to hide the hands on the owl mode using Ultra Magnus same parts. Now, let's go over with transformation. And while I'm transforming uh, Ultra Magnus to his owl mode, I'm going to be explaining how that I come out with that. All right, so let's start with transformation. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to hide the head of... Optimus Prime and so we're gonna remove the hands that way We're gonna pull this down like that as you saw it and here we're gonna hide the head We'll put this back over here now We're gonna put this down all the way down over here like that and We're gonna come over here. We're just gonna align the hands the arms like this um, They're gonna be a major part in helping us to fix this that little problem now put this down over here we can put that down in there now we're gonna switch turn around the waist and we're gonna push this forward and then we're gonna hear that clip and then we're gonna bend this over here like this and then this ports I'm gonna go inside in there so there we go There you go. Let's see the other side, the same thing. Um, apologize if I, I'm a little slower than usual, but like I said before, uh, it's past hours and um, just wanted to get over with this. There you go. And show you guys how to do this stuff over here. Now, uh, we're gonna put this over here back again. Um, now the hands, we're gonna align like this for right now. And a lot of people were doing this just to kind of hide him. Uh, so at least he pretends that you didn't see them. Uh, but in our case, we actually going to be need him to be like this. And we're going to go over in a minute. But first, we're going to work on the lower body. Right there. We're going to put it up. We're going to attach this together like that. Then we're going to flip this up. And here we go, right? That's, that's the major problem right there. A lot of people were complaining about that um, and yeah this is this is a, a, a big let down for a lot of people on it now I already have transformed the trailer um, and if you guys notice on the trailer um, there's a couple pieces that are missing on it that I I've 
felt that they had no purpose in it. And like I said before, they didn't have no purpose in it. And I just, I was playing with him and then I was trying to figure out the reason I came out with it. The first, the first thing I wanted to do, it was just, um, people were saying that they couldn't put any vehicle inside there. So I was like, well, maybe because it's, you know, too much stuff inside there, you couldn't put a vehicle. So the, these pieces over here, they're supposed to go in here. Um, at least that's what I read in the instructions. The instructions were saying that this should be like this, right? Let me see if I get it right correctly. Uh, like that, I think they were supposed to be. They were supposed to be like that. As far as instruction goes, they were supposed to be in here. Like like this right but i mean um what purpose those things those those uh arms a cupboard has in there there's no purpose i mean it doesn't hold anything it's just it's just basically storage now i'm going to show you the instructions if i have them here yeah so let's look at the instructions really quick instructions says that According to the instructions, where is that part? Yeah, according to the instructions, if you can see over here, you can see that those those uh, arms covers are actually attached to over here. Mm, I don't see the part. Oh yeah, here, put them over here. And put them in there. Oh, there you go. So there you go over here. So supposedly you put them in there and that was it. That was part of the transformations for the trailer, uh, but honestly, it doesn't have anything to do, or at least I figured out that they didn't have nothing to do in there. There was just no purpose at all for being in there, other than just being a store in there. Now, let's put this piece together. This is another thing that I noticed in some of the some of the reviews that I seen prior to this one. Uh, people were putting it like this when it's supposed to go like that. Um, oops, sorry. It's supposed to go like this. Why? Because, uh, if you see, just if you see this, I mean, it's not going to go like this. This is not going to be the top part. This is going to be the top part. Why? Because the normal vehicle is going to look like something that has on the top. So that's one thing. That's that in there. Now this over here. So. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna remove this over here. Let me just remove it out of here. And I'm gonna show you something that I like honestly come out with it. Put that in there. So this over here, if you can see, has the ports in there that goes attached to the forearm over here, right? This is supposed to go over here and it covers Ultra Magnus arm let me see if i got it right i think it goes like this uh, this is this one let's see yeah so it's supposed to go like that right okay so i was thinking like why that goes in there there's no purpose for it doesn't hold anything it's just a store right so then i noticed that it has that port and i thought but what if this can actually go in here and I start playing with it and I figured out that you can actually have it like this. Let me see if I get it right. Uh, let's see, this was not, I uh, got to get, you have to get the correct side, uh, correct side. And there we go. So you put on inside the fist. So this port over here, right there to the camera, you put inside the fist in there. And then you close it and voila, no more fist showing. And then you just come back again and now you can do it this in there or you can do it like separate like I just did it right now. I mean, I was just doing it just to show you how to do it. And I'm sorry if this video is taking longer than that, but I just want to make sure that um, people understand how that I come out with it. And I just want to make sure that this goes in there. 
There you go. Now this thing is falling apart. Uh, I'm tired of this snowman. Let me see. Okay, so there you go. I uh, just moved that just to have more space. And then there you go. So that in there. And nothing happens. You just attach it again. And there you go. So there you go. That's one hand cover. Now we go with the next one. Same thing. And we'll probably do it here. We just kind of follow the other one. And we're just going to... Uh, it's better if you actually put it out. You have more space to work on it. And the same thing. You're going to put it inside in there. Like that. And you're going to cover it like this. And then you go over here. And the same thing. We're going to see if we can put it in there. There you go. There you go. And now this thing is all over the place, but we're going to go fix it up. There you go. Cool. And let's put this together. Back again. Right there. So, oh my God. Sorry guys, this is late night, kind of tired, it's longer, taking longer than I was really thinking, but you guys already saw the main thing, which is this over here, that's what matters, so, okay, cool, and there you go, and now we just put the uh, trailer, we just attach the trailer, as we attached it before, now which ones am I using, oh, am I using... Yeah, am I using uh, this one? So, there we go. Let's see, put that together again. And we're going to attach this over here again. Right here. Try to attach it in there. There we go. Now the other side. Now this part is the one that I always get me. I don't know why I was doing the transformation for it and, and it just gets me. Come on. There you go. And we're just gonna adjust everything just to make sure everything is properly balanced. And there you go. No more hands. Okay, everybody, so here we have Ultra Magnus, all transformed. And as you can see, there's no hands. What happened with the hands? Oh my God, there's no more showing hands of Ultra Magnus. Wow, look at how nice that looks. How fluid. It looks awesome. Yeah. Looks nice, actually. I really like it. I really like it. And I did it with Siege as well. So, I mean, it checks out. You guys will see. Now I understand why Siege has the longer uh, shoulder. Because it connects over here in the back. Which is something that lacks over here. Uh, on this one over here. Um, so, I mean, unfortunately on that part, I think Siege is more stable. Because it's all connected over here. So, it doesn't allow it to move. Unless I did something on the transformation, but I doubt it um, because that's basically that's how that's how it says on instructions. But as you know, the instructions sometimes they don't really they don't really work. <laughs> they don't really explain as it should or common sense or whatever. I don't understand why they they pass that on that. I don't really understand that. So anyway, so this one is Siege, as you can see. Siege is all connected, which I like that because it's all one whole piece that connects very well to the uh, to the truck itself. And I did the same thing. As you can see inside, there's no hands. You don't see the hands. I mean, you couldn't see the hands because this is longer. Um, but if you can see in there, it's the same thing. I did the same thing. So it checks out. Now, 
I don't know if it was meant to be. I think it was meant to be like that. But for whatever reason, it's instructions and whoever put it together, instructions, um, did it probably understand that part. So there you go, guys. Um, I figured out something for you guys. And I hope uh, Hasbro will thank me, you know, promoting my channel, do something for my channel, something for me. So that'll be nice. Um, and then I'm sorry for the, all the people that I just ruined their three day business, creating something to cover the hands. I apologize for that. It wasn't my intention. I was just trying to um, uh, come out with something new. And here I am, you know, just a young, young channel trying to make a name for himself. So there you go. There's uh, Ultra Magnus. And let's remove this over here. Let's take this apart. So you guys can see what I did. There we go. Let's put that on the side. And if you saw the instructions, then you will see what I did. But you can look at it without the trailer. And you can see how nice it looks. I mean, it doesn't look perfect, but definitely a lot better than seeing the hands.